What is up guys, Cobra here, and welcome to Pokemon Diamond, where today we are starting, sorry, I'm picking up my controller, a brand new uh, randomizer Nuzlocke, where I'll explain the rules in a second once Rowan starts talking. Here they go. Hello there, it's so very nice to meet you. Well, thank you, Rowan, but anyway, I'm going to talk over you now. So basically, a randomizer Nuzlocke is where all the wild Pokemon are randomized, and the trainer Pokemon, and there's also a lot of other things I've uh, randomized. I've randomized TMs, I've hit the mic again, sorry. I've randomized... Uh, Static Pokemon as well, randomised uh, the field items, and in terms of Nuzlocke, a Nuzlocke is where once Pokemon has fainted, they die. So uh, <laughs> it's a very harsh mode, but you have to keep your Pokemon alive pretty much all the way through the game if you can. Obviously, if you have more than one, you can keep going. That's the rule I'm going to sort of take. If I've still got ones in the PC, I can I can keep going if they all die in battle. Anyway, I'm gonna I'm gonna use the. Uh, touch screen again to do this because I'm definitely it's definitely a real DS this right okay <laughs> Cobra there we go that is my name yes so you're Cobra I am a fine name that is now this boy here I believe is your friend yes it's Barry and I'm gonna call him Barry because of Barry the goat and people don't know, know what that means what my name I'll just press it I press B instead of oh for god's sake it's Nintendo I'm playing Animal Crossing and I can't remember the Nintendo controls still it's like transition from Xbox and Xbox controller to this is Awkward, even though I play on PC mostly, which just makes it even worse because there's just X's and Y's and A's and B's everywhere. Anyway, here we go. We're getting put into the world now. And now it's the thing about the red Gyarados, which you can't even catch on this game. That's in like silver or salt seal, I can't remember. I mean, you take a can catch it if you get a shiny Gyarados, but who's gonna get a shiny Gyarados? I could get a Gyarados in the uh, randomized starters. That's, oh, I forgot to mention that. I've randomized the starters as well. That concludes our special report. Search for the Red Gyarados. Brought to you by Tube Life TV. See you next week. Same time, same channel. Okay. Let's get started. I've got no bloody running boots right now. But we'll uh, we'll go to the options and we'll set the tech speed up fast. So uh, we'll do that. Oh, should we change his frame as well? That one. I like that one. Type A. We'll go with that. That's quite decent. Right. Let's save as well. Because the first save is always ages. So I may as well do it now. There's no potion in the PC. I don't think there is on this game. I hope not because I forgot to check. But uh, I don't think there is. Oh yes. Don't go to tall grass. See, what I never understood about this is, so in our, in this village, are we, are we just like trapped here because we can't <laughs> go into the tall grass? Because the only way to exit this village is to go into the tall grass. I don't understand. Thud. Oh no. What was that about? Oh, hey, Cobra. Hey, I'm going to the lake. You come too and I, I'll be quick about it. Sure. Apparently I'm going to get fined if I don't, I don't get there fast. Bloody find me, mate. I'll just use hacks to get lots of money, which I'm not going to do, by the way. I'm using speed hacks, though. Because this game is incredibly slow on its animations in battle, so I will use those occasionally. I will use them on animations, on just uh, health animations. Especially if you get somebody blissy or something like that, and you hit it with a super effective move, it takes so long for the health to go down. Also, I'm probably getting fined again. Hopefully not. Oh god, what have I just done? I've just made target FPS up. Now the game's going fast. How do, how do I put it down? No. Uh, oh, there we go. Oh, okay, we're done. Okay, I pressed 11 on my mouse and it worked. I've got one of those bloody fancy razor mouse things. Anyway, I'm gonna go to the lake. I'm gonna go to tall grass. I know it won't let me. I don't know why. I don't know why I bothered. Also, we're gonna speed up this walking because it's very slow. So I'm gonna use the speed hack just to speed up the walking because I's gonna take ages. All right, to the lake. Let's find the red Gyarados. Let's probably not. Let's find. Oh, sorry, my mouse is on the screen as well. I'll move that. Um. Oh god, it's Rowan and Dawn, is it? Is it Dawn? I can't remember. Fine, it's enough that we have seen the lake. Okay, so that's what they did. They just went to look at a water. Okay. Yeah, there's going to be a lot of rare kinds when we find Dialga in the bloody grass or something like that. That'll be good. Anyway, excuse me, let's pass please. Sure. We already let you pass Dawn. Oh, it is Dawn. Yeah, I was right. Beg your pardon, I'll be on my way. We'll... We already let you pass, so you could have just gone, mate. What was that about? Those two. I don't, I don't read this in the right tone, do I? I'm just like, really monotone, like, no problem, no problem. We won't be there long enough for a wild Pokemon to come out. But it is time for our starter. The starters are in the box. It could be a Darkrai, you never know. If it's a Darkrai now, it looks like I've just set it up, but... Here we go, the Starlies have attacked us, and it's time to find out. Let's look at this Pokemon first, actually, before we do the randomizer. So... The pictures will still be the normal stars, but they will be different. Here we go. And the first one is... Clefable. Meh. Um, and the second one is... Politoed. Meh. And the third one is... Laron. I'll, I'd take I'd take that, definitely, yeah. 
I'd take Le Leron. Is it Leron? Leron? I don't know. I don't know how you pronounce it. I'm going to look up the pronunciation. I would definitely take a Leron, though, because it evolves into Agron. Although I don't know, I'm a bit of a Pokemon noob nowadays, so I forgot how it actually evolves into Agron. Level 42, so it'd be a while. It'd be, definitely be a while, but I would take that. So, I've got to hope for number three. Random number between one and three. One. One, damn it. Okay, so we got bloody Clefa Clefable. That is, that is awful. Also, the starter keeps their uh, Pokemon throughout the entire game, so I've set that as. So I think they've got Lair on? Or is it. Or oh, they might have got Poly. Uh, I don't know. Either one of those two, they'll have kept it. Anyway, we've got Clefable. So at least we've got a lot of health. Uh, we've got Double Slash. Oh, thank God. We've got Metronome as well. That's okay, I guess. Um, I was just like, thank God. I was like, thank God we've got some moves that actually attack, because that can always be a risk that we don't have any moves that we can't attack with, so we literally can't need it. Yeah, use it. Needle Arm. Hey. That's not very effective, though, is it? No. <laughs> It's not very effective, but metronome is a useful move. Very useful. This early stage, anyways, is we've got no, we've got all normal moves, so we can get some uh, moves that, you know, are different types. Oh no, double slap, boom. We'll just keep double slapping you. Yeah, we've done it double now. Actually, quadruple technically. Damn it, he only hit two times. It actually was a double slap. <laughs> and metronome again. We'll just screw it. We'll just use metronome. Probably be a status move, won't it? Energy ball, hey. I forgot how Metronome works. I think, uh, is it only attack sort of moves? That wasn't very effective, but uh, it'll do. The only issue is you don't seem to have much PP on the moves that we've got. Yeah, I'll take a Clefable. I'm happy with that. Fwa, your Pokemon totally rocked. Mine was way tougher. I bet it weren't. Actually, if it was a lair on it probably was, but... <laughs> oh, there's the briefcase. The Professor would have been furious if I'd lost it. Well, he basically did, so he probably is furious with you. Did you, did you use the Pokemon in here? Yes, obviously, because we're mischievous and love to... Take Pokemon, I don't know. Sound like bloody Team Rocky or whatever. Anyway, what was that about? I don't know what's going on, Cover. Let's get out of here. My Pokemon got hurt from that battle. What, by a Starly? If we get attacked by enough Pokemon, we might be in trouble. Sure. You go ahead. I know we have to go into these Pokemon, but they're not ours. But I want to spend just a little more time with this little guy. What, is a Lair on a little guy? <laughs> Unless it's a Politoed. I don't, I don't know which one he's got. We'll not find out until we face him. Which won't be for a while. Oh god, here we go. More dialogue. Hey, those it's those people. It's that old guy staring at us. Is that old guy staring at us? I can't even read properly. Hmm. I heard from Dawn that you used our Pokemon. Let me see them, please. Mm. Clefable and Turtwig. Well, it's not Turtwig. It's, it's a different one. <laughs> um, I see that's how it is. Dawn, I'm going back to my lab. See you then. Um, yes, Professor. Please wait for me. I think you should visit our lab later. Okay, see you. Well, I mean, if he was angry, he could have just yelled at us or whatever. And he didn't want their poke. And the... And I can't even read. And, he, and didn't he want their Pokemon back? Jesus. It's why I don't read things. And we're back home. Hey. <laughs> What's up, dear? <laughs> wow, I can't believe that happened to you. I mean, God, they're both you and Barry are unarmed. <laughs> Imagine though if I'd just come up with like a Rayquaza. <laughs> yeah, he's intimidating apparently. He can't intimidate me and my Clefable. Hey, I got running shoes at least. So I can actually run now and I don't have to speed up to move everywhere. Oh, and... Doing this, we actually get to see our first encounter before the Nuzlocke actually starts, because the, officially the Nuzlocke does not start until we've got Pokeballs. So, we actually get a preview of our first encounter here. So, uh, let's see who we could possibly get, because, I mean, there's multiple Pokemon. It is... I forgot what it's called. Pasharisu. Meh. <laughs> it's so meh. But, uh, I mean, we'll, we'll level up a bit. We'll attack it. Metronome. Let's use Metronome on it. It used Bide. Great. How? It's basically more of a randomizer, this, isn't it? Using metronome. I, no, I didn't want a status move. I just wanted to attack it. But I'm going to use double slap instead then. Oh, I bet it's got bloody static, actually, because it's electric type. Hopefully not. Oh, God, it's so it's so weak, this Club Able right now. Can't even take out a level 2 Pachiritsu. Uh, I could sing it. That'd be useful. But uh, I mean, sing's a very useful move. I'm glad we've got that. Oh, shit. It's just unleashed its energy. Oh, okay. We would have been fine because the Nuzlocke, Nuzlocke hasn't started yet if we died then. Thunder Thang. That's going to be not very effective. That was pointless. Oh, we killed it. <laughs> be right then. So if we faint on the way to the uh, Professor's Lab, it does not count currently. But obviously, uh, eventually it will. There's a potion we can get out somewhere up here. I believe it's this guy in the grass up here. I knew I'd get any card just before I got to it. And this could be another preview we get. Bloody, uh, Parasect. Yeah. Not great. The important thing for me at the start, to be honest, is that they're catchable. If it's just a 
if I did just get like a Giratina, that'd be useless to me because what? I can't even catch it, so there's no point. Poison powder, great. <laughs> I, don't, I don't think I'm going to make it to the, uh, the what you may call it, the professor's lab. He tried to use Spud Stun Spot when I'm already poisoned, just skip the poison animation. We're going to die here, no matter what, so which is good. Uh, we'll use Metronome, see if we can get a quick kill in. Because then we can heal up with the potion from that guy. Torment, that's not great, is it? He was subjected to Torment. I don't know what this does, I can't even remember. Here we go, and about to die. Yep, <laughs> damn it. I dropped $40 in panic as well. How did I manage that? Now I'm back home and I can attempt to get through that grass again. I'll probably get an encounter in here again, will we? Yeah, I thought so. Oh my god, that would be good, but I wouldn't be able to catch it, so it wouldn't be good at the same time. Uh, now we need to fight him, because we need to get his uh, level up. Come on, superpower. That should be a decent move at this level, to be fair. Oh, it wasn't very effective. It did, did quite a bit of damage, though, for a move that's not very effective at this level, as well, to be fair. And it's, it's room I attack and defense. Vine whip, great. We'll just keep double slapping. Oh my god, it does nothing. We got three in, at least. I, I, I sped it up because it just takes ages, doesn't it? Uh, metronome. Call it punch. That should finish him off. No, it hasn't. <laughs> oh, it's a multiple. Uh, it's a multi move. What do you call it? I don't know. I don't know what you call it. He just hits more than once. That should be a decent tackle on me. Oh, it wasn't too bad actually. Um, metronome again. Screw it. <laughs> We're doing the true randomization. These are these are metro. Oh, Dragon Rage. Yes, bloody hell. That should definitely finish him off. Um, yeah, we're doing true randomization here with metronome, really. <laughs> and we're level six. Great, first level. Up. Gonna learn anything? Nah. Right, let's run. Let's get to this guy again. Come on. God damn it. <laughs> it's all it's all experience though. Oh, okay. Yeah, I'd have, I'd take that as well. Ride on. Uh, let's metronome. Double slaps gonna do no. Hail. That should do something, I imagine. Oh, it's, oh, oh, it did was cause hail. Oh, he crap, he used stomp. That might be powerful. Okay, we're too bad. Oh, I got cute, I've got cute charm. Oh crap, I'm buffeting myself doing this now. <laughs> God damn it. Right, Metronome. Metronome's such a useful move at this early stage when you've got just Pokemon that haven't really learnt the moves yet. Camouflage. I'm a grass type now. What, I, I was waiting what the fuck was happening. Oh God, he's in love with Clefable. <laughs> He still still stomped him though, it didn't quite work. I'm gonna sing him just to stop him from attacking, because I'm gonna keep getting stomped otherwise and I'll have to go back to the house again. I'll use metronome again. We're running out of metronome already. This is the only issue with metronome. Howl. No, that's not that's not that's useless to me. I mean I I guess it's alright if, if the attack rises, but Metal sound. That's useless again. I don't want metal sound. Metronome. Come on, get me a good move once. <laughs> Just one that finishes it off. Defensive. No, I want one that actually attacks. I'm going to end up dying to my own hail here. He's still asleep, Ali. I'm going to have to double slap him just to get some damage in. It's going to do nothing, though. <laughs> Jeez, no, there was no point of doing that. Oh, we actually got quite a bit. We got quite a bit in, and he was immobilized by love. That's why I need to watch out what I'm doing with a speed up hack then, because he could have got a good move in then. Roar of time. Oh my god. <laughs> yeah, that'll definitely finish him off, hopefully. Yep, yeah, <laughs> Jesus. Roar of time. Clefable just did Roar of time before Dialga did. Right, can we get to him this time? Yes, we can. Right, I'm going to uh, I'm going to heal with this potion because I can't bother to go back to uh, the house again. 32 HP already. Bloody hell. That's pretty decent. That's the one good thing about having Clefable. And we've run into... I forget not Pokemon is me. Snubble, that's it. Oh, we're level 2. Don't even know what type is, can't remember. I have to keep looking everything up because I'm, I'm a noob these days. I'm just going to go with Metronome. Well, what can I do anyway other than Metronome? I've only got one Metronome left as well. Takedown. That's going to hit me with Recoil, but it should do decent damage to him. Yeah. Yeah, one shot. Bloody hell. I didn't even take much Recoil either. That was pretty good. Come on, get out of the grass. No! With the bloody last tile. Snubble again. Okay, I'll just use double slap. I probably will skip through most of these battles, if I'm honest, because they are a bit monotonous. Skip through the double slap animation. 
Oh, we oh we hit him three times and killed him instantly. There we go. If I get Snubble in my encounter, that that that's that's him knocked out, isn't it? Because <laughs> that's the only thing I can do. Oh, there you are. Please come with me. The professor is waiting. Fud. Oh god, it's Barry the goat again. What? Oh, it's you, Cobra. Finally, you've come, Cobra. Was it? Let me see your Pokemon again. Well, well, you made your Pokemon evolve already. <laughs> you made your Pokemon evolve already. <laughs> to be fair, like someone could actually do that, couldn't they? Uh, there's bloody nickname. I'm gonna let nicknames be decided by you guys in the premiere and stuff. But nicknames probably won't be coming into effect until I get to Eternal City, because I think that's when you can ch finally change nicknames. I don't know when that is. I can't remember. I played this game through a, a lot from a child, and I can't even remember. So. That's good, isn't it? Ahem. Uh, Let's move on to the main topic. There is something I want you to do for me. My name is Rowan. I study Pokemon. First of all, I want you to know exactly what kinds of Pokemon live in the Sino region. Um, random ones, to be fair, because that's what I've done. I've randomised it. Um, to do so, it is necessary to collect the data using the Pokedex. This is what I wish to ask of you. I want to entrust you with this Pokedex. Will you use it to record all the data? No. I don't want to do your bloody work. Get I should get a wage for doing this. Fine, I will, for free. Slave labour. I also should get an Excel document up for uh, tracking these Pokemon, so I'll do that now. Right, she's gonna act as my mentor. I know everything that all this already, so I'm gonna speed through it all. You don't really wanna watch it either. There we go. Right, okay. Let's go buy some Pokeballs, and we'll get the three, five ones off her as well for the uh, catcher tutorial. So we'll buy about. We'll buy ten of these. I lost some bloody money, didn't I, when I, <laughs> when I got knocked out? Actually, I'll buy. I'll buy eight, and then I want to buy quite a few potions, because uh, I don't trust myself. In case we do run into anything bad, that we can heal ourselves up, we'll buy the max amount of potions. We'll spend all this money, lol. So we've got Pokeballs now. So the Nuzlocke has officially started right there as I, as I press the buy button. I'm going to get, uh, that's Route 202, so there's another new encounter there. Basically, how the encounters work, you get one encounter each uh, time you go to a new area. So every time the title changes up there, that's a new area, if you've never had an encounter there before. So... I've got to watch uh, her do a catch a tutorial now. Wait, what? Oh, I forgot. To, oh, I've got to tell Mum yet. I've got to tell um, I've got to tell your mother that I'm bloody catching Pokemon. So we can catch this. We can catch this first one now. Then, if we want, uh, from a uh, route two hundred one. Yep. So uh, we'll we'll not do it from this grass up here because we'll get stuck in there for ages. So we'll do it from the shorter one up here. We'll get it on the shortest bit as well, from like the end, so we don't have to do loads of battles. Right. Okay. So our first encounter. Of the series is here we go. Better not be snubble. Parasect. Okay, so yeah, we did do have a preview of all these earlier. I will take a parasect. I just want as many types as I possibly can, to be honest. So yeah. Oh, I forgot to go to the Pokemon Center, so Metronome's done for. But I, mean, I wasn't going to use it anyway, just in case it killed it. <laughs> we just don't want this double slot to do lots, otherwise this account is over. Because this Clefable's a bit beefy. <laughs> I didn't realize how beefy it'd be. Right, this should be the last one, please. Please be the last one. No. Yes, thank you. Right, okay. Poison powder. You can poison me all you like. I'm going to catch you now. I know it's only on yellow, but I'm going to attempt it. I don't know what its catch rate is. 27% chance. That's not great, is it? I'm going to put it to sleep as well. That'll help. It can't do anything to me. I could have done with hitting it a slight bit. I could do with having, like, pound or something. A move like that. That'd be really helpful if I, like, to just tackle. But we'll go for it. Half a chance to get another Pokemon. Damn it, it's kicked out after two. Right, okay. It's still asleep, so we've still got a chance. Within five balls, we should have 95% chance, it says, so let's hope. It's kicked out again at two. This is... I don't want to lose too many... We'll have a number five, at least, for the next route, but I don't want to lose too many Pokeballs. It's nice to have a good surplus on a Nuzlocke, so if you bring to a new area, really... You know you're covered in case... Oh god, I've, wrong, I've gone back. He came. You know you're covered in case uh, you're into something big. It kicked out one. Fuck's sake. So we're getting a bit low on his uh, health here, so I'm going to heal up. It's woken up. Great. <laughs> it's used stun spot, which it doesn't work because it's bloody... I've got poison anyway. Uh, let's sing it again. I've missed. I've missed singing. How can you miss... I'm already poisoned, so that was useless, weren't it? P Parasect. There we go. It's asleep again. Right, okay. I'm going to go for two more balls, and then I'm going to give up, because I know it's, it's only a Parasect, really, but it's just nice to have two Pokemon. It's nice to have a bit of contingency. 
in your team, I guess. Oh, you're kidding me. It was on three. Right, okay, I'm going for one more. One more. One more ball. I did say two, actually, to be fair, so... Yeah. One more, and then I'm going to I'm gonna end it because there's, it's just ridiculous. I've used too many Poke Pokeballs now. There we go. Right, last one. Parasect is in his team. Okay, good. So, uh, I'll add that to the list. Parasect. And we caught it. You can't even see this XL document. I might show it on the video. Might not. Don't know. Bug Grass. That's decent types to have. And it's got some decent status giving moves that I can use on wild Pokemon that I need to catch. So, there we go. And that is a Clefable Poison, but uh, they don't die on this game, luckily. So, uh, we're, we're fine. <laughs> and we're going to got there in time anyway. And we're all healed up. Is Barry here? No, he's not. He's out drinking or something. I don't know. I'm just gonna skip through this. Yep, 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 yep. Thank you. Right, let's go. <laughs> I'm giving. If you if you want to know what it is, watch somebody else or just it was. I, I'm supposed to give Barry a town map. That is literally it. I'm gonna put Parasect out front as well to level him up a bit. So we haven't got experience share yet. I don't even know how to get it either on this game. Let's go. Oh my god, we didn't get an encounter. I'm gonna save as well. Okay, there's an encounter. <laughs> For God's sake. Right, we're gonna snubble. Parasect should be able to take this out, hopefully. Uh, I, I like this. Uh, I like this move set. To be fair, nice variety of types and diff different uh, status effects, which is good for when we want to catch things. How, how well is a tackle gonna do against this? Oh, okay, three. That's not too bad actually. Um, let's use a leech life. Even though it was shit back back in the day, I think leech life <laughs> gets me health back up though, doesn't it? Oh, not too bad. That's that, what that only healed one. That was definitely not one HP. That unless that snubble has like two, two HP overall. I'm gonna do a scratch. Oh yes. To be fair, the bloody uh, oh no, he's using charm. To be fair, the um, the what you call it, the uh, leech life is uh, is stabbed. To be fair, so I wonder if it does so much more damage. I just wish it, I wish it'd heal me a bit more. And that should be the snubble done. No. Wow. Okay. So what was that then? Was that a crit the other one? I, I, I don't think it was. Alright, let's just use a scratch and finish it off. At least scratch's got a lot of PP as well. Oh, the last bloody bit of grass again. It always gets me. Venusaur. I don't I don't I don't really want to face Venusaur if I'm honest. I'll uh, I'll poison him. Poison him. Vine whip. Oh god. Oh it's not it's not very effective, good. I wasn't sure if Karat Grass would have been super effective. Oh yeah, poison effect. It's a bloody poison. I'll use Stun Spore instead. <laughs> and that didn't affect me. This is just a, a, a bloody battle of not effectiveness. Right, at least she's stunned now. I'm going to bring Clefable out. Then hope he's still stunned and then I'll just finish off with a uh, metronome. A good metronome move. Or oh, double slap. Probably go for double slap. Money. Oh yes. Critical hit. I'm finishing him off. Nope. Oh, yeah, that should finish him off, hopefully. Nope. Finish him off. Yes, that should finish him off, definitely now. Yeah, there we go. That's some good XP we're getting, though, off of this uh, Venusaur. Okay, maybe not. <laughs> oh, we're going to level 4, so it's, it's good either way. And we got another 44 for Clefable. Oh, just almost. Oh, we can also get another encounter in Lake Verity. I forgot about that. I'll, uh, I'll get the Pokeballs, and then we'll go back and do that. Another, another thing as well is we get the old rod soon. So there's water down here in uh, Sandgem Town. So Route 219, I think it is. And then there's water up in uh, Twinleaf Town as well. So there's, that's another two encounters we can get. So we'll do the catching tutorial now so we can get more Pokeball. Uh, we'll go for his Route 202 encounter now as well. And then we'll go back round to uh, Lake Verity. And we'll, we might end it there. Or we'll go on to Jubilife. I'll see what I feel like. Anyway, that's a bit of That's because it's the actual tutorial. I'm going to skip through this. You know what? How to catch things yet. Got some Pokeballs. Hey. That's, I'll have eight now, I believe. So we'll get us first encounter on Route 202. Which is going to be... We'll get it on the end one. Actually, no, we'll get it on this end one. Because we're going to go back round. But we've got one anyway. Here we go. And it is... Bloody Poliwhirl. I will take it. I'll take anything at this point, at this early stage. Obviously, later in the run, that'd be pretty crap, wouldn't it? But I'll poison him. Should I poison him or should I stun him? I'll stun him for now. Use water sport. 
fire's power is weak and luckily I don't have any fire moves anyway, so. I've missed the stun spot. Great. Well done, Parasex. You're brilliant, aren't you? Oh no, not Hypnosis, for God's sake. Oh, I should have gone to Clefable and Sled. Damn it. Yeah. Right, I'm going to have to switch out to Clefable, but I bet he uses... I've ran. I, nearly... I, I, I pressed that by mistake and thank God I couldn't escape. I pressed bloody run by mistake. Right. Clefable, come on. Let's get him out. Her out. Not Hypnosis again. Thank God it missed. I'm going to Hypnosis you now. Sing. Yes, I'm faster. No, you missed. Don't Hypnosis me. Don't. Yes, he water sported and he failed as well. Sing. I've missed again. Water sport, thank god. What is this battle? This is the most stupid thing ever. Sing. I've missed again. Water sport. Is, is it going to be so long but before? I'm going to miss this again. He's going to use a uh, thing, isn't he? Yeah, missed again. He's going to use hypnosis. No, he's used water sport. What is, what is this battle? For Fable. Missed again. Hit, there we go. Uh, yeah, thank you, game. Thank you so much. That's so typical Pokemon, that, isn't it? After all those missed sings. Right. I don't think he can attack me. That's the thing. So I'm going to just... I'm just going to keep singing until I wake up. <laughs> I used, There we go. I got him back. Right, okay. And now I'm going to metronome him and hope nothing powerful comes up. I, I trust I'm not that concerned if I don't get this. Waterfall. Okay, that won't do much to him. Shouldn't do anyway. Yeah. Okay, I didn't do quite enough that I wanted though. He's woken up already. Jesus. He keeps using water sport. I'm gonna have to. Oh no, I should have used the sing. Damn it. Frustration. Oh god. That might kill him actually. Oh no, that's good. Yeah, that's good. Right, I'm gonna check what the catch rate is for this and then we'll see if we can start throwing Pokeballs. Not a great chance, so I'm gonna try and put him to sleep again. Why can't I hit Sings? Now he's using Bubble. He's actually attacked me finally. He could have done that ages ago. There we go. Right, we've got the Singing. Come on. Right, okay. He's asleep now. So, being asleep, I've got a 78% chance. So, this should be a pretty good chance unless this site's lying to me. Seventy-eight percent chance, eh? But to be fair, I, I, this next one, if, if I'm not unlucky, it should it should uh, it should be a cat. Yep, ninety-five percent chance after two balls. There we go. Polywall, Polywall, Polywall is ours, and uh, he's also got hypnosis and. Uh, a water type move so I'm quite happy with that getting some nice variety let's not get an encounter thank you right okay we need to go down to Lake Verity we could have four Pokemon here not failed to capture a uh, encounter yet can't say that for my last recording because I did actually record this before but my microphone glitched up so I couldn't uh, <laughs> couldn't use it so uh, and I got a Dialga on my first encounter which I couldn't catch obviously uh, so route 202 Poliwhirl I think we'll end the episode here after we catch this next one. We've got some four encounters and we'll carry on with the trainers in episode two and go on to Boot Jubilife City and get some more encounters there. So Lake Verity. There's also Verity Lake Front, which is like around here. There it is. But that is, this issue has no encounters you can possibly ever get, so that that do not really count. So Lake Verity. Uh, let's go on these M ones here and we'll take out we'll take out Clefable again because they they did quite well. Or we could go with Poliwhirl to get some XP. No, we'll go with Poliwhirl, Yeah. Kill, kill Pokemon that we just got. Yeah, let's do it, Brad. Uh, obviously, I won't hopefully do that, but you never know what could happen. But I want to sacrifice... I'd rather sacrifice Poliwhirl than uh, Clefable. For a wild Pokemon, anyway. Last encounter, come on. Machop. Uh, yeah, that's fine. Although, I can't actually get my champ, I don't think. Which is a bit shit. But, uh, yeah, we'll, uh, we'll hypnosis him. Maybe I think hits a bit more than Sing, I hope, so that'd be useful for me. I wonder if we could game straight off the back, because it's only a matchup. Might be able to throw a Pokemon, uh, Pokeball straight away. It's only level 2 as well, that's not great, is it? Got, already got a 50% chance, so if I do some damage to him, it should be pretty decent. Do a little bubble. Uh, we'll, we'll hit him again, just to, just to confirm it. Oh, he's woke up, for fuck's sake. He's used low kick. Now we'll just put him to sleep again. Hopefully Hypnosis hits. There we go. Hypnosis seems a bit more reliable than a uh, Sing. And we'll Pokeball. Got six attempts at this. We should get it. It's only a matchup. 
Very Gen 1 themed uh, team we've got here, isn't it? Batch up. There we go. But yeah, as you can see in Twin Leaf Town, there is a pond at the bottom of Avia, so we can uh, fish in there later on once we get the old rod in the next episode. So, guys, been Cobra playing Pokemon Diamond, Randomizer Luzlock, episode 1, getting four Pokemon pretty decent off the bat. We've got a pretty. I, I, I'd say a pretty nice team matchup, obviously. I mean, a lot of them, they do need leveling up, but especially matchup. But it's it's not bad for that. But I'm quite happy with that. Very Gem 1 themed. I think it's all Gem 1, isn't it? But yes, I shall see you guys later. <laughs>